good morning guys welcome back to today's video today Sophie made a pasta from scratch which I think is super cool I love fresh pasta she made it really thick because that's how she wanted it well it didn't turn out that good it needs to be like thinner and wider really thinner who told you oh. thinner <laughs> you said like cut them in half I know and then I said I'd even cut them in half again well this one's really thick so you can have this one well, I think they still need to be cooked a little bit more. Take a piece to cut one and try it. It is gorgeous outside today. It is 55 degrees, maybe even more. But now that the horses were out here, I have more poop to clean up. One thing about the dogs, they just keep pooping no matter what. So, they're... And now that all the snow is gone, I'm finding more little piles of dog poop. So that's on my agenda this morning. I just want to get all that stuff picked up. Whoa, big birds in here, big dubs. Three of them. Blankets are all off. Horses are all naked. Oh, Stormy boy is laying down. Penny's like, I'm coming. Hi, sweet girl. They look so happy today. And muddy. Hi. Whoa. Were you laying down? Hey. Oh, she's like, yeah, I rubbed my butt. <laughs> yes, you too. Get up on my account, just lay down. I love a horse laying down. They're so pretty. Like, look at him. I love them in this position. Doesn't he feel look amazing? You having a nap, big guy? Do you guys remember when we first got horses and we were like amazed every time we found them laying down? Yeah. Yeah, you need a brush. Maybe we'll brush you in a little bit. But there he is, sleeping in the hay. Even has his eyes closed. He is such a handsome man. You enjoying the sun, Stormy? Yeah? Or do you guys know how like I keep saying that he's so confused, like Penny is like living with a hormonal woman, like she's just crazy. And he, all he does is just walk near her and she goes nuts. And I know he's like, he's lived with a lot of boys in his life. A lot of them. <laughs> and he can handle that. But it's like the girls just throw him through a loop. Penny just throws him through a loop. Yeah, you know, you're such a good handsome man. <laughs> he's so big. Look at those chunky little thighs over there. <laughs> yeah. Stay down. Oh, he pinned his ears at Gracie. Will Gracie be looking good? She's getting her summer body on. Although when you have grass fields, the summer body tends to be a little bit thicker than <laughs> what you think. Be nice. Why is everybody gotta be mean? I don't understand that. Why do animals have to be mean? You got nothing to do all day but eat. Ugh. It's grooming season. <laughs> See those ears? She's like, don't even start. Don't, Penny. It's because I'm touching her and she wants me just for herself. Treats or no treats. Oh, look, now the baby's laying down. It's nap time. <laughs> You're really cute, too. Oh, yeah, what is that? Hi, baby, don't be bitey. Hi, sweet princess. Oh, she's gonna lay down. Look at you, all chubby. <laughs> Sophie handles her all the time when she's on the ground, so she's used to this. You got dirt everywhere. Oh. And then there's Storm still laying down. Once the heat comes, everything just feels so much easier. It just feels like you can get outside and do stuff. It's still kind of windy, but oh, and it's not hot, but it's gorgeous. And I want to just come out here and clean up all the poop in the paddock as well. I love it. So somebody in the comments suggested that we make this the riding arena because it would be so easy to just bring in more stuff to more footing stuff just bring in stuff to level it and and just it's already all dug up 
So it would just be building the arena, like building the outdoor arena. Salmon I don't think is big enough though. I don't know. It's something that we might consider. I don't know. We'll see. I just hate the idea of digging up our our grass, our food that we feed the horses because I love having them be able to graze all summer long. It's like so important for them and so important for me because I feel like it makes them happy. I leave the TV on. I'm done with your sad eyes. I can take another night with you on like this. So let's go. I'm sure you can take it. You've been crying over him for a lifetime. So if you don't mind, we will dance till it's way past sleep. Another cause that we can fly with the baseline. I know, I know, I know, I know. Boys be boys, ain't no excuse, babe. Now hey you, oh hey you. I know you can find someone better. Oh hey you, oh hey you. Stop digging holes, Molly. All right, so Sophie did not love her pasta. She tried it instead of that. Did you try it? Mm -mm. Try it. I don't think it's fully really cooked either. We know some people that are going to like it. And by people, I mean chickens. Throw some in the back so that, oops. <laughs> Who else's ladies had it first? Do they those. like it? <laughs> one came running in with one. I don't know. I know chickens really like pasta and they seem to really like it. Oh, that oh. one's gorgeous. These ones like it. You like it. One of the chickens that we've been showing you guys all along how cute it is. Hold it up there. So she's a silky crossed with a with an Easter egger. So she's gonna lay like whatever color eggs, but she's so cute. We have never had spring in February before. February is usually one of the coldest months ever. <laughs> this is like unheard of. I just wanna get everything cleaned up. I'm gonna get all Sam's junk pile over here cleaned up. I just wanna work. It's amazing how like all winter you just want to sit there and do nothing, but then spring happens and you're so excited to work. Can you tell that it's dinner time? <laughs> it's getting cold. I feel so bad for Willow because I took her blanket off this morning and I touched her and I didn't get shocked by Gracie, but I shocked Willow. Aww. Willow's fit and wouldn't let So do you think we should put blankets on tonight? I mean, they all have a hefty amount of hair. Well, it's actually supposed to be warm tomorrow, but rain. So they'll probably have to get them on in the morning. They'll probably have to get them on in the morning. Oh now. my goodness. Get them to put it on now. All right, yeah. Do it now. <laughs> and give him a big brush. Tell your girl. Blankets make them, make their coat go down. And now he's puffing up because he... Hasn't had a blanket on. He, he looks black dogs. Yeah, like what is that? It's his hair. Is it his hair? It's almost like he has hives. No. It's hair. Yeah, that's weird. This is the side he was. Look. Look who's being chased. Everybody's dirty. It's dirty season. You gotta put their blankets on. Gotta put their blankets on because it's gonna rain tomorrow. What? Honey, come here. <laughs> Ruby. Ruby does not love the horses, you she, guys. She has like poofed up spots too. Get over oh, here, no, little missy. <laughs> <coming for you. laughs> she likes to chase Ellie. Be careful. Hi, Pen. Hi, pretty girl. You stay clean. This is the season that I hate. I hate when She's like, well, I want food. I hate when blankets come off, but it's still like wet and still muddy. 
that little Ellie tries to sneak away. I know, I just love being out here when it's like spring, I know. You shouldn't have more than a t-shirt on. Everybody's going in. All right, let's go because they're- All right, we wanna tell you something bad about our baby, our baby goat, baby Winston. We noticed something really yucky today. But I love looking at the horses with, with no blankets on. Look, she comes to Sam. Look, go. <laughs> she knows. There she goes. Come on, Willow. Look, he calls them and they come. Wow, that's really cool. She's coming. She's she's the last one. She's a slow poke. He's the Storm Penny Willow. Storm Penny Willow and then the bay and then the pa ba and then the Palominos. <laughs> the baby's so sassy. So here's the problem with <laughs> Gabby, call your dog. Our boy. He's a week old now. He's exactly a week old. And today we caught him Friday, I think. Oh, so he's a actually mm, I think so. He's exactly a week old and today we caught him doing big boy stuff to Lola. one of our goats, to Lola. So all this time he's we thought short, we thought he was just chasing Lola for fun because Dad, call Ruby. he liked her because she was a baby and she doesn't have horns so it, she can't hurt him. But really, he was in love with her. He's in love with us too. And they, <laughs> what? He's in love with us <laughs> And then we were sitting on the ground playing with him today? Uh, get Ruby. Ruby! Hey, come here. So we're just sitting there enjoying our day, just relaxing with the goats and playing with him. <laughs> and he kind of liked us too. So only takes a week for a baby goat to feel armorous. <laughs> and there he is. <laughs> Look at my so this baby is, boy anymore. <laughs> so this is him. <laughs> A week old, and he's grown like 10 times already. Like, he's so big. He's he's triple the size that he was when he was born. He's still too short for Lola. And he's too <laughs> short for Lola. <laughs> Poor Lola. All this time, he just wanted to mate with her. And she was letting him today, so Hi, she boy. must be in heat. So We're this is probably the last time that they'll be together. He'll be with Lola because he can't stay with well, the girls. just wait till Lola's out of heat. Yeah, so he'll have like another few we weeks. Know she was in. Hi, boy. Another few weeks. Look at her. She's she has such. She's like she is so focused. I actually fallen. Whoa. Bite, huh? He's annoying that boy, isn't he? These two older doves are literally my favorite. Yes, you and her. <laughs> it's starting to feel really close to them because they're starting to to adjust to me, and they're starting to be like super friendly with me. Uh, when I was editing yesterday's video, I noticed that Mocha was standing behind me and just standing there like so close to me and I've never done that before. And then uh, Tilly has gotten really close to me too. Ever since we started messing with their udders, they've gotten a lot better. I love this. This is my favorite part. I love- If Winston follows Lola into her stall- Winston is in love with Lola. If you haven't missed he, it, if you missed it- her. Yeah, he kisses her. He loves her. His mom's over here and he's over here. All right, three, two, one, go. Good girls. <laughs> As he goes in with Lola. No, he doesn't. He knows where he goes. Uh-oh. Oh, Come on. You got so much food over here. We give her so much food because... Don't steal their food. There you go, boy. Because she's nursing and she needs to build back up. Oh, you. Everybody else is perfect though, but last night when I let them in, he went running right to his, he went running right to his bed. Like he knew exactly where to go. He's so cute. He's gonna probably look like Tilly. He's gonna be a brat, just like, <laughs> just like his uncle. Well, his uncle bit him and he's not gonna be like that. He's gonna be sweeter and friendlier. All right, put him in his bed there. Nice though. Yep. Oh, Jesus, be careful. He's like, wait, don't leave me. One day we're gonna come out here and they're, those two are gonna be out of their stall. Yeah, they know how to escape. He's doing super good though. Like we've loved it. It's been so effortless having him. Like I honestly was so worried and so prepared and so, and the truth is he's just an easy baby. 
He's a quiet baby. Like I've seen a lot of baby goats that are not quiet. He is quiet always. He's just a little frisky. <laughs> Good night. You're wondering about when we're gonna find and start looking for Sophie's lease horse, lease to buy horse, a horse that if it works out, we'll just buy it. But we want to lease first. Time. But if you're wondering, Brandon is away this week, and then when he gets back, is game on. Don't you know that you're